adventurers welcome to wild florida we're getting ready to head out on an airboat ride today so we just want to say thank you so much to wild florida for having us out today we do appreciate it and we are ready for the thrill of our lives we got patty from the g team here and her grandson logan let's do this guys okay this is the check-in and gift shop area actually come in this way this is the parking area chomp house grill area mr. alligator greeting us to go into the gift shop I have to do this for John it's the glitzy you go that way it's green and that way it's silver oh my gosh John will love that Some spices oh, that's pretty okay guys let's go to this back room let's see what else they have back here Lots of wild Florida back here. Some sweatshirts. I love those colors. Awesome. That would probably be my choice. The bright colors. Oh, that's cute. Life in the slow lane with Mr. Sloth. Oh my gosh, look at those sloths. Mm -hmm. Mr. Peacock. They did have a peacock here. Oh, scary. Are you venomous? Here's a airboat ride toy for $19.99. Alligator nest, tree wildlife officer, alligator. Oh, there's an alligator. Everything in there you need for the tour. Oh, yeah, I think this is where you wait for the airboat. It's a nice area to sit on the roof. Look at these little gators just hanging out in their pool. Out here behind the gift shop. Go off for a swim. All right, guys, we're making our way to the airboat ride waiting area. Oh, how about that? Lisa's already here waiting for us. You're in the right place. This is the airboat waiting area. There's the water. Here's a little bit of a history about airboats. And apparently the very first one was built in 1905. And man, they look a lot different than they do now. Pretty cool. In the 1930s, they started to look more like they do now. Um, they look really similar, actually, to the ones of today. It's beautiful out here today. Nice benches out here. I can't wait guys. I'm so excited to get on this airboat. <laughs> we are not going down the dock. I want to give you any ideas. That's so cool. Making our way down to the airboat loading area. Such a diva. I even bring my purse out here on the airboat. You are a diva. That's why we all love you. I can't wait. We're all just so excited with the anticipation. We're ecstatic, Patty said. So let's do it. You do? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. All right. We do doing this. So we're gonna put on our ear protection real quick. Yeah, let's try these out. I gotta fix this thing. That's good. We're headed out, guys. Yeah, we're excited. First time. <laughs>
Check out that amazing eagle up there, guys. This is so awesome. There's another big gator right there. Okay guys, this is the Chomp House Grill. This is the restaurant on property here at Wild Florida. And they have quite a few options to choose from. And we're about to get our food so you guys can see what we got. We're headed into the pavilion here to grab lunch real quick. There goes Lise. Patty and Logan are already in there. Look at this nice decking and a picnic area. Very cool. All right, so we got our cheeseburger here. We got some mac and cheese and a side of coleslaw. So this is the kids meal, chicken tenders and french fries. This is the pulled pork and french fries and sweet cornbread. Sweet cornbread. Look at the size of this fan, guys. If you're in this pavilion during the summertime, that will keep you cool. It's huge. All right, guys, we are headed into the Wild Florida Safari. It's a drive through safari, and we're about to go see some awesome animals. Oh, I think that one's going to the bathroom. <laughs> What's this? Oh, my goodness. It's five miles an hour. Five miles an hour. What is this guy doing over here? I don't know. I think he's coming. Okay. Sorry, bud. Look at this guy. Oh, my gosh. This is so cool. Here he goes. Wow, that is amazing. What's up, buddy? Hi. Sleeping. What you doing? I'm sorry I caught you, at, you know, in your private moment. Have a good day, okay? Hey, Lise, is that a camel? I think that's a camel. I think you're right. I think I see a camel, guys. I love camels. I used to work with them. This is an alligator breeding marsh, home of rescued nuisance alligators. So I guess if they become a nuisance in the neighborhood, they'll bring them here. That's awesome. I see some out in the water. I just saw one. I just saw a head. There's one over there. See it? See him on the bank? It's a big guy. Oh, yeah. There's a bunch of them. Look at these little guys. So this is called a Watusi. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that looks like either emu or ostrich. I don't know. So apparently their horns are very light. They look very heavy, but they're very hollow. They're like a honeycomb, and they have hardly any weight to them at all. It's actually a symbol of wealth in Africa with the Watusi tribe. You know that a tribesman is very wealthy if they own one or more Watusi cattle. 
Oh my gosh, look at this little guy. He's running. He has a ring in his nose. Does he really? Yes. Look at this little baby. Look at this emu. He's strutting his stuff over They're here. Look at these guys running. It's a herd. I think those are like antelope or something. Let's just take a second to admire the beauty of this oak tree, guys. That's awesome. These animals seem like they're very well taken care of. Look at that mama and baby, guys. Wow, look at these yaks. They're awesome. My goodness. Or are they water buffalo? It's beautiful in here. Look how beautiful. Oh, it's like an oasis. This is a Zorse. See the zebra stripes on that white one better. Well, that is so cool. And look at the size of them. Zebras generally are a lot smaller. Okay, this is called a Zorse. Cross between a zebra and a horse. You see this, and it's huge. Definitely bigger than a zebra. This is really cool. I like it. It's relaxing. What's up, buddy? Are you a Zorsi? He looks more like a donkey or something. Looks like we hit just about dinner time here. Everybody is enjoying their dinner. <laughs> he likes He's talking to Patty over there. Hi, buddy. Cattle crossing. Oh, I almost hit the car. Oh, oh wow. That was close. See that one? Stampede! That's a big one. Look at this. Wow. This is the coolest thing. They're going to bed, I think. That's like a buffalo baby. Oh my goodness, guys. That is a little bison, the one with the white chin in front of that Watusi right there. That is a bison baby. Hi, Look little babies. Them, must be dinner. Yeah, going they're dinner? going to bed. They're putting themselves in that barn back there. Uh, okay. I think. Probably have a sound or something that they do. They know. Oh. Here comes another one. Watch out. Oh, that's a Brahma. Is he amazing or what? He's awesome. Look at that guy. Whoa. <laughs> Hi, dude. What's he doing? Just These are one of my favorite animals. Oh my goodness, they are huge. Wow. The size of these guys. Go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. There you go. Hey, buddy. Okay. All right, guys, check it out. They also do have zebras and giraffes. There's the giraffe house right there. Looks like the giraffes are in for the night. They're about to close. Oh, here comes the giraffe. There he goes. There he goes. That was awesome. He decided to make, so, an appearance. He did make an appearance. How about that? Good night, guys. So that was a really cool experience, guys. We didn't have a chance to go through the Gator Park today. Our time was just very limited. Um, it was a three hour drive to get here because we didn't come from Orlando. But if you're in Orlando, we highly recommend that you do come check this place out because I can guarantee that it won't be the last time. So much fun here, there's so much to do. Like I said, we didn't even have a chance to do everything, but the safari park where you drive through is really an amazing experience. All right guys, we had an awesome, awesome time today here at Wild Florida. The airboat ride was so exhilarating and we highly recommend that if you are anywhere near the Orlando area, it's only about a 40 minute drive, much easier and more convenient than going all the way down to the Everglades. So definitely <laughs> make sure you stop by this place. It's so cool. They have several airboat rides per day and they do even have nighttime rides, which I would love to come back one of these days and do that. That would be amazing. So with that being said, we'll see you on our next Raptor, Raptor Adventure. Adventure.